Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone having a wonderful day. Johnny Depp, the divine full Italian jazz. It's the big night for Jeff Beck and Johnny Depp. On the Santa Giuliana stage, everything is set for the festival's closing concert, which will feature the legendary guitarist, one of the biggest ever, and the star of Hollywood, reduced by recent judicial setbacks in the case that saw him prevail Man over his ex-wife and Amber the Biglietti have been sold out for weeks. Johnny Depp arrived in Perugia yesterday, surrounded by a cordon of complete security and solitude. The mythical Jack Sparrow of the Parati of the Caribbean chose to stay in the Hotel Brufani in Umbria Jazz's general area, where Jeff Beck had reserved 16 rooms, following numerous reports that surfaced in the days prior on potential destinations. Whoever who encountered him describes him as being extremely calm and serene. Wearing black stivaletti, black pants, a dress, and a cape upon arrival. When he entered the Brufani, he was directed toward the piano in the room as if he wanted it to play, non e accordato. Today's Superio is focused on Umbria jazz and a city that is currently celebrating and moving to the beat of the great music. The official numbers for this edition, which has in fact ended the reprint, will be announced by Stamani. The focus will next be entirely on the Santa Giuliana, where Tom Jones was triple billed yesterday. Regarding Jeff Beck, who attempted to leave the hotel with his wife yesterday afternoon despite the extreme heat, he has won eight Grammy Awards and has been listed by Rolling Stone as one of the 100 greatest guitarists of all time. Rhonda Smith, Annika Nils, and Robert Adam Stevenson will be seated Jeff Beck at recently the released the album 18. Unusual Fact Johnny Depp will be honored at the Arena del Frontone with the 23.30 showing of his first and only leading role. The Brave, which was presented in competition at the 1997 Cannes Film Festival. Emmanuel Filiberto and Fausto Bertinotti, who met and engaged in a brief conversation yesterday in Perugia, were also among the crowd. Stay tuned with Gossip Time. Thank you for your support. Goodbye.